Hey guys, welcome to Outlaw Edge Bladeworks. So I got some exciting news to share with you guys. Um, Heidi just bought a new shop, and it's uh, new to us, but it's not new in any means. Uh, it was built in like the 60s, I guess. It's a metal building. It's uh, 40 by 60, but the the footprint on this place is it's just huge. There's a 52 foot shipping container that comes with it that's here on the property, and uh, so we're gonna get all that stuff emptied out. And we've been in here the last two days just hustling ass trying to get everything out of here. It's uh, the, the people that owned it, they had a business in here and they worked on diesel trucks and stuff like that. And so it's just a wreck. And there was so much stuff because this place has been in business for a long time. And there was so much stuff uh, underneath all the workbenches and all that stuff. And we bought it with all the tools, the compressors, the welders, the property, the house, we bought everything. And so now we have to clean everything out, which sucks. But I'm bored, it's a Saturday, and that's what I'm doing right now. So it comes with this new compressor behind me, and all this stuff right here, all this metal was underneath one workbench. Uh, it has this solvent tank, and then another solvent tank, and it's really cool because this is a like an antique style building, uh, really vintage, so there's a lot of vintage tools in here. And I'm gonna walk you around the shop and show you what we got going on. So uh, this old vintage, this is an old uh, bandsaw, really old. And uh, the thing is amazing. It works really good and whatever. But uh, I'm not sure if we're gonna keep that in here or we might put it in the storage container for now because it's something that I, I've used in the, in the past at the other shop. But uh, my buddy threw this in here and said, you know, if you guys want it, you can have that too. But uh, this old refrigerator, it's a real old fridge. There was metal that was literally right here up to the edge and it was just piled on top of it. You, can, you couldn't even almost see this refrigerator. And this is full of welding rod. Whole bunch of welding rod in here. So we're gonna get rid of that. I'm gonna keep the welding rod that I want. A lot of the stuff is uh, obsolete. It's old stuff that people don't even use anymore. A lot of Nyrod and stuff like that. We've been working our asses off cleaning and this is this pile right here is just sweeping off the floor. This is stuff underneath the workbenches and whatever. And you can finally see the walls. So we're finally getting that all cleaned up. And my son wanted this workbench. So we're cleaning this up and we're gonna move it. And it came with a, like I said, it came, this place was full of tools full of tools and welders and generators and compressors and all kinds of stuff and everything came with it and it uh it's got five acres so we have plenty of room to pile all of our junk cars and stuff behind the shop it's got a house on the property and my son will be moving into that which is really awesome and uh kind of give you a little tour right now in this corner we finally cleaned out there was a whole bunch of uh seats out of trucks garbage cans and paint and just all kinds of junk there's a wood heat we're getting rid of that we're actually getting going with uh, propane heat and we're gonna mount them up on the ceiling so this will be coming out of here real soon I got it going today just to keep to stay warm because it's uh, like it's about 20 below zero or something right now I don't excuse me I don't remember it's nice and chilly outside so this morning what I'm doing is this whole workbench was full of tools and metal and you can see over there all the metal that's over in the corner and uh, I'm gonna get rid of that, put it in the metal pile. And this workbench I'm ripping out right now and cleaning up everything. There, there was nails and stuff all over the place and uh, all on the walls. And so what I did is I took and uh, cleaned up all that stuff and uh, just got rid of it so you can hang stuff, you know, clean up the walls and not have all the crap hanging on the walls or whatever. And one of the projects is right here and all these nuts and bolt bins, they're gonna be going away. It has upstairs for upstairs storage, whole bunch upstairs. But uh, I'll try to do some more videos on it real soon and show you what, what we got going on. <clears throat> and then underneath here, this is where we're gonna be putting all of our uh, welders and tools and all this stuff. It's like a little mezzanine or uh, whatever you wanna call it right here, a little work area. And you see all these uh, joists, we're gonna put our lights in between those and put our welding table and stuff underneath here. So you have a work area and then the whole footprint of the shop will be wide open. And then all these rooms you see, those are all getting ripped out. It's just useless, wasted storage space. 
and er we'll have storage space upstairs so we can put all of our stuff up here. But uh, I'll try to make some more videos soon, let you guys know what, uh, what we're gonna be doing in here and whatever. And uh, just wanted to show you what we had going on. Really excited about this. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching.